Hey guys, it's Powell, and welcome back to my YouTube channel. For today's video, I am going to do another paint with me, but I wanted to throw in a little bit of a twist. So today I'm going to be doing a house painting. I do a bunch of custom house paintings for commission sales and all of that. I talk about that a lot in my first YouTube video, but anyways. So I'm going to be doing a watercolor house painting, just a small one on a 6x9 piece of watercolor paper. For the twist, I'm going to be only allowing myself to spend an hour on this painting. That does not include the sketch, it just includes the inking and the watercolor. I usually spend two to three days on a custom house painting just to make sure that I am spending enough time to get it right and add all the necessary details to really bring the piece together. Now, since I'm only giving myself an hour, I know I'm gonna probably struggle with not adding enough detail. I really want to learn how to loosen up my paintings. I find that I am always just adding more and more detail and I want to learn how to do some more loose paintings. So today is just for practice and I'm bringing you guys along with me as I try to loosen up and see what I can get done in just an hour. Alright, let's take it to the overhead view so you guys can watch me as I attempt this one hour watercolor house painting. Alright, welcome to the overhead view. As you can see, I kind of already have a sketch down for this house painting. The first step I take when doing a house painting is I do the sketch and then I take a fine liner. I'm using my Tombow Mono drawing pen in the size 01. This gets a very crisp, very thin line down just to outline and like all of the different shapes and everything on the house so you don't lose any of that detail when you're painting. I will do that and then I will come back once it is done. All right, I've done a quick outline of everything and now I just need to erase all of the pencil marks. All right, I just finished erasing all of the pencil marks and I ended up adding a little bit more tape to secure this down to my desk a little bit better. Because I'm not focusing on detail as much in this Paint With Me video, I thought it wasn't necessary for me to really explain what I was doing. It's pretty self-explanatory. I'm just mixing each color and putting it where it needs to go. So I'm gonna let you guys sit back, enjoy the music, enjoy the speed paint, and I'll catch you when this is all complete. All right, enjoy.
that is this one hour house painting all done. And now for the best part, time to peel off this tape. After that super satisfying tape peel off, I think it is time for a well deserved montage. That is this quick one hour house painting all complete. I'm actually pleasantly surprised with the way that it turned out. I mean, I take literally about two to three days to do an actual house painting when I commission them. So it was a very nice surprise to see how this painting turned out. If you liked this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up. Click the red subscribe button down below to subscribe to my channel and click that bell icon to get notified every time I post a new video. I hope you enjoyed this one hour little paint with me video. For me it was an hour, for you it's much less time, but I hope you enjoyed it because I sure enjoyed filming it for you guys. Alright, that's all I got for this video today. I will see you in the next one. Bye!